What's poppin' Pisces? I'm Laurel, and welcome to Love Pisces in this mother sucker, baby. Join me as I read you, you all's lives. Thank you to everyone who has liked, shared, commented, subscribed to my channel. Baby, you already know I appreciate each and every single one of you Pisceans. Yes, I do and if you need to get a personal reading from me make sure that you hit that description box down below and check out my website laurelsmoon.com for any other magical purposes and deviation workings and things of that nature so pisces make sure you check out my weekend readings my four questions for 35 dollars and 55 cents starting friday to saturday via video only okay now, I might have to reiterate some other videos with the fuck's going down because, you know, some people don't be knowing the rules and things, all right? But with that being said, Pisces, I want you to light up, smoke up, toke up, drink up, kick your Pisces motherfucking feet up, baby. We about to see what's going down. And I need you to go ahead and press that like, share, and subscribe button. I need you to go ahead and put your attendance on in, okay? And I need you to put chocolate in the algorithms. Now... Today's we today's read is platinum cake. Okay, and I did a little mixture of some new shit, but I ain't gonna tell y'all about that until a little later. Okay, now with that being said, Pisces, this is going to be for my sun, moon, rising, Venus, Venus, North Node, and for my South Node, and also for my Mars, baby. We about to see what's popping. This person's next 48. Y'all know how to line up. Go. All right. Now, if you don't know, now you know. To all of my OG subbies, I want to give a special thank you. You guys are the motherfucking shit. Even if your ass don't write nothing. Okay. Even if you just listen. I love you, babe. Yes, I do. And to all of my new subscribers, I'm very much appreciative that you have found your girl. So you can get your giggles and sniggles in, okay? So, with that being said, let me go ahead and get my disclaimers out if you don't know how I am already. I smoke like a juju train. And I curse like a 19, a 19, uh, 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 54 sailor. Okay. Straight like that. So, if you don't like that shit, go ahead and click your ass the fuck on off. I will be talking about your partner, your person, okay? Your ex... Okay. I can be talking about that new ex too. Whatever the case may be, Pisces, we about to see what's popping. Okay. Now, I like this platinum cake. I like it when I get the new things. Okay. They're like toys and stuff. Little adult toys and things. Okay. I like the way this turns. Now, with that being said, this video is sponsored by King Psychics. Get that description box. Under Love Pisces. Link code. Okay, let me go to hand and get some of these smears and and things off. Okay, get real proper like. So for my Pisces, you know I love you, baby. Okay. I want you guys to like, share, and subscribe. Yes, I do. Now, let me put these motherfucking glasses on. Okay, make sure my wig stay on tight too. Here we go, Pisces. We about to sage, and I'm giving give you my clear audio messages, and then we about to get into what's popping, what's really popping, okay? So if your ass is sensitive, click your ass on off. Click off, click off, okay? Click that, click that off button. Straight like that. Get up out of here. Get your ass on. Straight up. I don't need no fuckeries. Pop. Straight like that. So, Pisces, let's see what's going down. Spirit, you are welcome into this Piscean reading. You must sage the cards. For all of my Piscean gods, baby. <laughs> 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 
You gotta add that doggy ball set on, baby. Okay, so with that being said, Pisces, I think I might be choking in this video, so y'all gonna have to let me put my lungs back into my body. All right. Let's see what's happening for you, Pisces, for your person. The next 48, y'all know how I do, baby. All right. If you're like, oh my God, the realm, please don't talk about my person like that. Click your ass off. I ain't got time. I told y'all, let me bring you your little grandma ears over here, okay? And your little grandpa ears. A little sensitive. Oh, okay. I don't have time for that shit. I really don't. Straight like that. So, with that being said, um, I have the tower here, very first card. Um, I haven't even, you know, shuffled the deck. And this is what's here, okay? So, I don't know if your person is going... Listen, we didn't got the tower. We didn't got the page of swords. We're a good week now. Okay? Been going on a week. All right. Check back on the other videos and shit if you need to. But somebody... That was in the current. All that shit. Kept getting the tower. So, there are some sort of plans that could be disrupted. Okay, somebody might be having, they might be an outcast here. Okay, having emotional outbursts and things. Okay. Now, clear audio messages. Let me get this shit out of the way now. All right. You know why your ass is here, baby. Okay. You know why. Now, with that being said. I keep getting that for some of you all, um, someone is like literally going crazy or in cycles or they feel like they are on repeat, okay? Or somebody is doing the same repeat over and over again, okay? I don't know if this is Groundhog Day or if this is somebody trying to wake up and, you know, smelling the motherfucking coffee. But I kept getting um, that somebody's shadow side is uh coming out and it could be with other people all right i keep getting shadows shadow side um i don't know if this person has mustered up some guts to take care of their shadow side or doing some shadow work but i kept getting shadow okay so i don't know if this motherfucker follow you like a shadow or they got a shadow that's around them but i keep getting that this person has either dark energy or they're consistently going into some sort of fuckery. And it might be time for some of y'all to just step on back. Okay. Now, in their next 48, very first card I already have is the Tower here. And I haven't even shuffled the deck. Okay. So, somebody is in chaos or they are having some regrets. And there's a flash, a realization of some sort of truth. Or this could be a blow to their ego. But we got to see. Okay. In the next 48. In the next 48. So. Here we go. I feel like I'm doing some sort of crime series, baby. Okay. Now, I don't know if somebody is uh, fighting crime or they are a criminal. But we about to find out. Okay. This person's next 48. Where my Pisces? I can't. I couldn't believe it. That tower kept showing when I when I was shuffling. Oh shit. Well, I'll take it. Alright, Ten of Wands here. Page of Cups already. So somebody could be dealing with a work environment. Seven of Swords. Shit. Seven of Pentacles and Six of Cups. My God. Okay, so I already got my glasses on. Okay, we doing this. <laughs> Pisces, what the fuck is this? Already? All right, this could be something that's happening in the childhood or something that's happening with a child. All right, I'm already getting this. Could be a work environment or someone that you possibly might work with, whatever the case may be. Put it and flip that motherfucker and flip them bitches like pancakes in your world, how it goes in your world, okay? But I feel like for some of you Pisces here, um, somebody's going to be caught lying. Okay, this could be at a job or with children. I mean, you got multiple messages here. Um, I'm also getting for some of you guys, uh, 
with this 10, it definitely could be uh, somebody who's ending something here. Let's, damn, I mean, I can't even, I can't, bitch can't even shuffle. And the cards is like, here you go, okay? So somebody might um be having um throw up mouth, okay? Every, all the words and everything that they learn and see and do, they might just be throwing all the words out, okay? But I feel, yeah, full energy here and also with the eight of swords. <laughs> So, yeah, somebody is fumbling and fuck, fucking up the ball, okay? All right, straight like that. You need to go ahead and sit down and get red shirted, okay? So, they has on down and try again next season because I feel like somebody's getting ready to get caught. What's the Seven of Swords here for? I mean, damn, Spirit's like, tell the story, bitch. Tell the motherfuckers. Three of Swords here. This could be a family situation, family environment, but somebody is heartbroken because they are in fear or they are fearful of some ending here with a child or also like the heartbreak of some sort. But yeah, I mean, damn, the motherfucker don't have nothing good ever coming to them. Whoever y'all be dealing with in a 48, baby. Okay, so this is somebody who's either got some blows to the heart or somebody is... Uh, Seeing a lot of change, okay. Seeing their plans disrupted with this three of swords and full energy. I mean, damn, you can't make this shit up, man. But definitely some situations with a family or a mom or a mothering energy here that this person is trying to avoid. All right, King of Wands here, and also uh, Knight of Pentacles. So I feel like this person, there might be some plans that are disrupted, yeah. Could be some endings here, but I'm seeing Leo, Sagittarius, Aries in the next 48. Um, but I'm also getting something about children or younger children. Eight of Wands and Seven of Wands. So your person is very guarded. Five of Diam. Five of Swords here, so they feel defeated. Okay. Told you, bitch, been punching the air so many times that. This motherfucker, it just feels like they flatline her, okay? This is what this moon energy is all about, baby. So, let's ask why the tower is here. But I feel like somebody's truth has come to uh, whatever they were seeking or whatever they were looking for. It was disrupted, honey. Boop, stopped in the middle, okay? The Aptarian in reverse. <laughs> I don't even re reverse this. could be a Cassadian energy here. What is going on, my friends? All right. Now, let's see what's really popping because I'm feeling like for some of you guys, like there's just like this, um, like I said, this vibe of somebody having issues. Okay. This could be their choices or whatever they're wanting to choose. Um, but there's multiple things that could be the problem is what I'm seeing here. I mean, damn, you got the chariot in reverse, the five of swords. They are in their motherfucking head, honey. So, let me get this period deck. If I had her information, I sure would post it in the description box. Hopefully, she'll send me... Um, something that we got fucked type of shit you on thief that's what just flew out and we got send off broken promises oh shit and self sabotage what is your person doing baby We got, I know, this some sh bullshit, but damn, I love it. Self-sabotage. Wow. Definitely could be dealing with the Kansetti and a Leo, Sagittarius, Aries, and I'm seeing a uh, possible Scorpio and Kansetti in here for sure. But wow, broken promises, and I know this some bullshit, but somebody's getting ready to self-sabotage some shit. It could be stopping themselves from... You know, moving forward, okay? But this also could be somebody who's flatlined her. They are just, you know, uh-uh, baby. Uh-uh, this some dusty-ass energy. Straight up. 
So some of you guys could have turned this person down or there could have been some things that you um, let go of with them and they are pissed off. All right. Also could be some sort of truth, okay, or someone's truth. I feel like uh, the game of like cat and mouse, okay, somebody like blocking each other or someone blocking um, and unblocking here as well. This could be something that's on the low. All right. This also could be like talking about each other. Sheesh. Here we go. What the fuck be going on? Shit. I mean, is they a karmic? My nose is itching now. Shit. Give it to me for my Pisces. This person's next, 48. For some reason, I'm going to use my witchy cards, too. Fuck it. Go all in. You got the star energy here. So this could be an Aquarius, all right? But I feel like somebody is trying to see the light, but they got a lot of hold them back, okay? They could be holding themselves back. They also might be, uh, you know, crash dummy, Okay. <laughs> This is the crash dummy, y'all. We got the star and also the king of cups in reverse here. So this could be someone who is got some issues with their emotions, showing their emotions. Okay, them up like could act like a like just angry all the time. That's what I'm seeing here with this king of cups in reverse. Okay, this also could be somebody that's um, feeling like other people could be a threat or there's always some sort of emotional threat. Oh my goodness, Pisces. Nine of Pentacle energy here in reverse, also Queen of Pentacle. So this person has a hard time pulling away from someone. This could be a Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. I'm also getting uh, with this Magician energy and Addies, okay, or a possible um, Virgo or a Gemini. So I feel like somebody is trying to create some sort of miracle or something from out of their their tools or. There. I'm getting like power tools or like fucking power drills and shit like that. <laughs> what kind of home improvement shit is this? Oh my goodness. You also, you also got the six of wands. <laughs> okay, what was the neighbor's name? Shit. Motherfucker did never show his face. But anyway, I'm getting with this magician energy here. There's definitely somebody that feels like they are in a loss or regret. I mean, I feel like your person is just always fucked up, okay? Like, it's always some, like, like damn, bitch, is it ever a happy day? Shit, bitch. That's what I feel. Shit, five of cups here. Like, they just have no hope. They always, you know, worry, downplaying shit. All right, that's what I'm seeing here. Somebody could be grieving as well, too, though. All right, but they have definitely suffered some sort of losses, what I'm seeing in the next 48. <laughs> Five of Cups. Come on, bruh. Now. Okay, somebody's making some wrong choices. And they just, mm mm mm. Just, mm mm mm. Mm mm mm. And bless their little old heart. Okay. Five of Cups. This is a loss of regret. All right. Somebody is, it could be a breakup or somebody that's saying goodbye to something or something. All right. Or somebody that's in sorrow and sadness. Let's see what these, uh, what is these called? Oh, I forgot, yeah. Let's see what they have to say. All right, we got Journey. Daughters of our mothers, walkers of the unknown, take with you on this journey all that you own. Oh, shit. So they like to travel in circuits or something, okay? It's like they uh, go state to state. <laughs> And run away from their problems. Could be from their daughter, their son, their mother. That's what I'm seeing. Somebody got to walk a long ass mile. Shit. All right, they taking everything with them. You got rooted. May you never tear the living ritual. That magic is merged with the roots of your being, the soil of your soul. Yeah, somebody is like something is being uplifted. Pull it out, all right? They are might be going out of the race, pulling out of the race here with this journey. 
Straight like that. Mm -mm -mm. We got coming of winter. It comes in lullabies deep within your mirrored flesh. It's time to lay your quivering chest upon the winter coming. So yeah, this person is definitely thinking about being shut out. Okay. But I'm getting a lot of grieving here. Somebody is grieving and they say this. Now, Pisces, don't you be in my motherfucking comments about that. It's just so fun. <laughs> Listen. Okay. This is what the cards are saying. Okay. But well, we got greet the darkness. So, yes. Like I said, somebody's slipping into darkness. For real. All right. We also got reflection coming out and the underworld hand over your unknown the ship is near take a leap your journey is clear so yeah there's some sort of bail or something that is uh becoming unbeknownst to this person all right but somebody is getting ready to see some tears as well let's see with the other cards and then i'm gonna get the fuck on out of here but yes Pisces, listen baby i feel like um is that the sirens it's like I be trying to avoid shit in the video and it just be there. Okay, so speak ancestors. Somebody is flatlining. Real tough. They're going to have to start over on their journey. Or they might be having some issues. Okay, with their heart pumping and breathing. Straight like that. Bam. I'm trying to avoid that shit. All right, we got, I'm good. They not good. <laughs> wow, mad, mad coming out. And motherfuckers talk too much, period. And I just be knowing shit, intuition. Whew. Yeah, somebody, they heart pumping. They been seeing something crazy is what's getting ready to take place, all right? It says, I'm done with this shit, and they mind about to pop out. <laughs> Says, play with me if you want to. Trouble. Oh, shit. And bitch, unexpected is the very next card after that. I got to stop looking at this. Okay, shit. All right, Pisces, let's see what's popping. Because, damn, I feel... I feel sorry for their mama. <laughs> what she doing? I'm done being menace. <laughs> she knows she was going to trigger that motherfucker. Okay. But somebody's seeing a lot, and they're very mad here, and they're very triggered. All right. All right, don't get mad at me because I'll be seeing the darkest of the dark and the light of the light back. Yeah. Because this motherfucker's in trouble. Give it to me. Poor Pisces partner. This is more like, seem like karma to me, shit. This motherfucker has some trouble on the way. We got justice. Uh. So whatever is next, this mother, there's something. Mother Earth is like, bitch, we cutting this connection off. Fuck what you talking about. We got the Eight of Pentacles here as well, too. So somebody is feeling lost or like they have to find um, what's next, okay? Or like I said, they lost in the sauce, baby. You got the Emperor in reverse here. Could be dealing with an Eddie's Tower at the bottom of the deck. It's like Spirit be telling me, read this shit, bitch. Read it, okay? Like I told y'all, this person might be having some sort of struggles. But what's this tower? What's happening with this tower, Spirit, please? All right, we got the Ace of Pentacles, King of Swords, and Eight of Cups. Wow. Damn. There go that snake. Yeah, somebody's definitely breathing here. Okay, you got the Two of Wands. This could be over a partner or a person, but you got the moon energy coming out. And the devil, baby, is out to play with the moon. So, yeah, somebody's fighting some serious battles here. Herophon as well, too. They might be having a hard time uplifting themselves in their spirituality or just naturally can't get right. Okay. So, let me get my cards and then I'm going to get the fuck on out of here because I'm seeing, yep. I don't know why my nose start itching when I start talking about y'all people. Okay. It's like, bitch, what you want? See, what is this? And I know it ain't no business because I got a mirror right here. Okay, no, I'm not vain, but I'm just saying, baby. You got to check yourself. Uh, okay, X is for a reason popping out. And something's missing. Yeah, somebody just stole something. 
Okay, three of swords here. Sheesh. Ten of swords right behind the end of judgment. Oh, wow. And I just picked up this deck. All right. So, both, all them cards together. I mean, damn. They about to see their final judgment, okay? Whatever it is that they believe in. All right, somebody's getting ready to see it live and live in motherfucking action. That's what I'm seeing here. Okay, if they've been doing dirty deeds. Shit, no deed goes unpunished, straight like that. Let's just say that we got the laws here. And gotcha, bitch. Uh-oh. <laughs> Somebody's in trouble with the law, baby. This could be something on the internet or somebody that posted something on the internet here. Uh-uh. Bold face lie. And knock, knock. So somebody got the laws coming at the uh, door at 6 o'clock. Okay? Or somebody's got the police involved here. The jakes, the 50s, whatever you want to call them, baby. Somebody had to get some sort of third party involved. Now, we got extra and watching through the phone. So, there is some shit going down that's extra. Or somebody's watching through the phone that's extra. But we got influence and snitches get stitches. So, it's a whole bunch of jail cards here. Straight like that. Or somebody is definitely lying. This could be somebody's zaddy. I'm also some, yeah, we got do anything for clout and hood rat. <sighs> Cousin Pete, that's the card that flipped too. So, in conclusion, Pisces, I'm seeing on the next 48, there's going to be some bodies, okay? Or, yeah, it's some out of pocket shit about to happen. Could be uh, talking about some money. All right, somebody might be going to go see their ancestors as well, too, because that is at the bottom of the deck and haunted. <laughs> I cannot make this shit up. <laughs> All right, but that's just real talk. You got to say that shit because, I mean, that's what the fuck's on the cards. You know what I mean? So, yeah, I'm seeing for a lot of you Pisces, somebody riding that short bus. Uh-oh, and we got alien invasion. So, yeah, somebody's either getting ready to have a knock at their door or there's something unexpected that's going to be happening to them with that tower um this could be somebody yeah locked up damn and tv wires this could be somebody that lied about hooking some tv wires or some car wires up or something like that but somebody about to go to jail baby okay and if they ain't going to jail this motherfucker got the laws watching they ass strongly and heavily all right, or something is haunting their ass for sure. It could be a spiritual battle, especially with that judgment. All right, so if somebody's about to get got. That's got gotcha, bitch. <laughs> I love saying that shit. All right, my loves. Yeah, locked up just fell out, and the laws is just all up on it, honey. Straight like that. This judgment and this three of swords just look like somebody is seriously in pain here. Or there could be somebody that's doing some um, some illegal shit, okay, on the low. And they getting ready to get caught up straight like that. Now, I'll see y'all in the next video, but somebody in trouble. All right, babies. Peace.